Hey guys, welcome to the Dean's office. It's uh, December 26th. It's the day after Christmas. I hope everybody had a great holiday season. I know we were real busy at the Bash U and uh, we had a lot going on the week leading up to, uh, to the holidays and I hope you had a chance to check it out. We had a Bash U live uh, before the holidays that featured uh, Kevin Van Dam and Gary Klein. Some amazing stuff. If you haven't had a chance to uh, to view that, you want to go back and check that out. Kevin talks about using his sonar and his side scan to to find the subtleties that those ledge fish get on. It, it was an incredibly valuable piece of information, as well as Gary Klein's flipping and pitching discussion that we had with uh, me and Mike. Great stuff. Check that out. Bash you live. Uh, last week was also talking about fishing lines. Uh, check out Gamma Line. You can find all that stuff at the uh, Bash University Tackle Shop. And old school lures. Uh, talked about some great ones. Here's a couple of them right here. This is the uh, original floating minnow by Rapala and the original shad wrap. Two amazing old school lures uh, that you don't see guys throwing as much, but guess what? They're still effective, still catching fish. Uh, this bait right here is the first quality bass I ever caught. It was right there on the original floating minnow. Still an excellent tool today. I talk about the silver minnow um, for fishing vegetation. And this time of year, uh, the silver buddy, which is um, a great tool for cold water conditions. So that was all done last week. Uh, we've got a lot of great stuff coming up this week. Uh, Dave Mance, who just gave us an update about what's happening in Texas fishing right now, uh, giving us an idea of the current conditions down there. So check that out on our social media pages. Our ambassadors every week are delivering uh, some great information about what's happening in different parts of the country. So check that out. We've also extended our holiday promotions for, for you guys that might want to come to a class or for new subscribers. Our hat promotion and our stocking stuffer promotion is going to be pushed till January 1st. So we still got a little time uh, to take advantage of that. Now, this week, we're launching some really cool stuff. One of which is something that I want you guys to watch. It's a, it's a, it's a valuable piece of information that I developed uh, over the years on how to get my lures clean. And it's using an item called a magic eraser. If you're like me and you, know, you fish a lot, you get rust, you get corrosion in your baits, it can ruin a whole tackle box. But watch this video. It's amazing how you can bring lures back from the dead uh, that you, can, you were going to throw away. But a magic eraser is an amazing tool that'll, that'll take the, the rust stains right off, take the scars right off. It'll make an old lure look new again and get catching fish for you again. Save you a lot of money, a lot of time. Uh, so check that out this week. And you don't want to miss Brent Ayler's uh, part two on how to use sonar. Uh, to catch bass. He gave a wonderful seminar uh, just a couple weeks ago about how to do that exact thing. This is part two, a little bit more in depth on how he's able to identify fish, catch them off of his sonar screen. Uh, sonar continues to be the number one requested seminar that we get and we deliver big. Brent is the best at it, so you want to check that out. That's Brent Ayler's part two sonar and that's coming up later on this week. So that's what's happening at Bass University TV. I hope you had a wonderful holiday once again, and I want to wish you a happy new year, which is coming right around the corner, and I will see you right after that holiday next week with some great new features for Bash University TV. I'm Pete Gluzek from the Dean's Office.